ninth and soars to tenth. And Jason Keller in ninth, he has now moved into sixth place in that points championship chase as we're back to green flag racing. That was a huge break for all of those wave around guys, but in particular, David Rudiman, who had that problem getting his car restarted after that green flag pit stop. Jeff Burton takes advantage on the restart. Three wide, further back. Looks like everybody's going to settle down at least for turn three. One four car drifts up there. No harm, no foul. Look at David Blaney at the 87. He's digging now. He's got, he had a... A little bit of contact early in the race off turn four. There's Kyle Busch. He gets underneath the 38 of Jason Leffler. A lot of oh, 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 no, contact. The 38 gets into Darnell. Leffler loses it. Here comes everybody else. Look at him. Oh, 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 there's Kenseth involved. Oh, 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 gets involved for the second week coming. in a row, but this damage is much worse than last week's, where he nudged the wall. This time he spanks it. Yeah, you see Darnell getting out of the car. A little bit of fire underneath the six. I don't know well, exactly what happened. Looked like the 38 got loose down there. I think exactly what Rusty Wallace was talking about on these restarts in the countdown show. You go down in there on the inside, you don't have the air on the spoiler. You're driving hard. The car bottoms out a little bit, shoots you up the